Democrats in the state of Wisconsin are lashing out at Governor Walker's plan for implementing the health insurance reforms. Today, Walker again supported his plan, and tonight, Fox 11's Kelly Schlicht has balanced coverage. Former Congressman Steve Kagan says he can't wait for the health insurance reforms to begin. No longer will a family go broke and lose their home just because a child or a loved one has a serious illness. That's a good thing. My patients can't afford to go back to the way things were. But Kagan, who is an allergist, says Wisconsin is stalling on implementing the provisions of the law because of the governor. Governor Scott Walker chose not to build a state-based health insurance marketplace or exchange. Instead, Wisconsinites who are uninsured will have to enroll in the federal programs. Kagan isn't the only Democrat in the state of Wisconsin speaking out against Governor Scott Walker's stance on the Affordable Care Act. On Monday, Senator Tammy Baldwin released this letter saying that Walker is deliberately stalling on the implementation. Today, Walker told us that's not true. It's just a political attack. They, they don't know the facts. In fact, the letter that was sent to us yesterday completely ignores the reality of the past year. Our Department of Health Services and our Office of the Insurance Commissioner have done almost every one of the things that uh, the letter sent to us asked for. Baldwin's letter asked for a state-run insurance marketplace to be established. She says that would help the 92,000 Wisconsinites who earn above the federal poverty line and who are being kicked off of Badger Care. But at an event today in Oshkosh, Walker said those people no longer on Badger Care will have the chance to get health insurance, but through the federal plan. And for those living above poverty, we transition them into the marketplace and we've given them every opportunity uh, to successfully uh, find a way to, to make that transition. Online enrollment for those federal insurance programs begins next week. In Oshkosh, Kelly Schlicht, Fox 11 News.